It's like two and a half times your body weight. People don't understand that. When you're running, you're putting two and a half times your body weight on your feet, and your fit and ankle. You know, there's a lot of force there. Two and a half times on one foot, because when we're running, obviously, you know, uh, two and a half times your body weight on one foot. It's funny because no one has foot and ankle problems until they hear that I treat the foot and ankle all of a sudden, let me take off my shoe. Can you look at this real quick? Dr. Vanessa Barrow. From Houston, Texas, born and raised, Houston's third ward. You know, so I wanted to approach or create a different uh, field, you know, in the world of podiatry, brand it differently. If a woman goes in and say her feet hurt and heels, first thing he says is, well, you know, let's get rid of the heels. But I wanted patients to know that, how about we don't throw away the heels, let's find out why your feet really hurt. And so patients would see me dressed like this at work, I mean at the office, and you know, they're like, she's wearing her heels too. I wanna, you know, I know she understands that that's what I wanna do. I wanna wear my heels, I wanna feel pretty, I wanna feel confident, and you know, I don't look like what other podiatrists look like. It feels like being a role model, you know, and, and just kinda changing the game, and that's what it's all about. That's one of the reasons, you know, because I've been practicing for 17 years. I wasn't always the hot dog in heels, but I saw that there was a need for somebody that looks like this. You know, when they see my website, you know, this is, this is exactly what they see. They see some of my photo shoots from the magazines and, they, and she, she gets me. And, that, and I've had patients come specifically because of that, because they want to see or they want to be treated by somebody that either looks like them or they want to look like that. My first post was 2018, <laughs> you know, like, welcome, you know, to Soul Aesthetic, we've opened our doors. Um, so I never was on social media. And in the process, I've actually hired and, and let go of social media uh, uh, businesses, you know, digital, you know, business, whatever, because I felt like I could do it better myself because, you know, I, I have my, my finger on the pulse, you know what I mean? No one's really going to understand it better than you. But the fact that I can do what I want and help patients the way I want, I love it. I mean, the, the, my business is my baby. It really is, that's a baby. And like I said, I mean, if I were to show you sketches of me drawing the logo, and, and I, I posted this one time and I said, just so y'all know, I was like, my hand is in every single thing, you know, in this business. You know, I've got sliding glass doors and, you know, and it's more like a spa field. And they're like, you don't look like a podiatrist. Your office doesn't look like a doctor's office. You know, this is all so different. And that's, that's what I wanted to create for my patients, you know, no matter what they're coming in for. They can come in for an ingrown toenail or, you know, dermal fillers, I don't care, you know. But, but this is, you know, the world that I wanted to create.